What's up YouTube? This is Ken from Ken's How To's and Reviews. So today I am going to show you how to replace a battery in a 2006 Toyota 4Runner key fob. So these key fobs come I believe in models uh, the 4Runner model 2003 to 2006 or it actually might be 2002 to 2006. Uh, this is your key fob. <clears throat> so all we're gonna do is replace the battery. So what you're gonna need is a flathead screwdriver and a tiny little screwdriver to get the battery out. I'm using a pair of scissors today because uh, I don't feel like walking down to the garage to get a flathead screwdriver. But anything you can use to wedge into the top of the fob to wedge it open, that's what you can use. So I used a pair of scissors. I just twisted, it came off, and here's your, here's your batteries. So something uh, I wanted to hit on is that there are a lot of different sizes of three volt batteries. So a common mistake is that people just get a three volt battery um, but as you can see here, uh, this is a CR2016. So I'm going to pop this bad boy out. And it will shoot out on you. So here is the battery that goes inside the fob. Uh, and just to give you an example, this is a 2032. This is a 2025. And you can see there are varying uh, thicknesses of these batteries. This one is a, again a 2016 and it's very thin. It's kind of wafer thin. So we're going to get a replacement. I got these on Amazon. They're much cheaper on Amazon. At Walmart they are $5 for two batteries. I paid $5 for 10 batteries. So it's going to be worth it to go on Amazon. So you take your battery plus side up, pop it in. If you're doing this for the first time without a case, I'll just show you this little circuit board in here comes like this. So if you buy one of these and you already have one of these, just remember your two red buttons go toward the lock and unlock. So two red buttons down, battery opposite of the key circle. Then, pop this back on. Good to go. Thanks, guys. Have a good one.